Know your job, G. Just follow the fuck out. Make him use. Talk about Greece. Right, so you come from A2 Italy, which is Division 2 Italy, it's not the top league. Mm -hmm. You go to Greece, which is top league. Just talk about that experience and then what happened after it. I was playing good in Italy, got the job in Greece, and everybody was looking at me crazy. Like, uh, it's your assist, you got the timer badge? Like, uh, nope, like I wasn't supposed to be there, but then when I landed there, everybody was like, Man, we heard you was really good. I played against all the best teams, to be honest. I think I played against Ike, Pana, and Olympiacos in like the first eight games. And then what did you have in those three games? Those are two Euro League teams too, by the way. Uh, I guess Olympiacos had like 34, to be honest. And we almost won. I think we lost by like five. Or it was close the whole game and we ended up losing by like 10, something like that. Pana, we got smacked, but I had like 28. And uh, I guess Ike, I had like 25 or something. And then uh, I had a Euro League offer from Basconia and it was a no-brainer. They had to buy me out for like ten thousand or something, like minuscule, and it was it was easy just to say, "All right, I'm out." And then, how did the NBA situation happen with with the Suns? Uh, after my first year in Basconia, I guess uh, one of the Suns GMs was there watching Bogdanovich because you know they uh, drafted him. Yeah. And he was playing Fenner, and I was killing. I think I I, I was killing. I had a lot. It was one of my better games that year. And uh, they just wanted me to, wanted to come see me play in summer league, so I went and played. Uh, ironically enough, Book, it was Book's first year. And so I went and played, but they didn't have no more roster spots. And then when I got some like little offers to go to camp, or like like uh, minimum offers to like come play, uh, I still had a buyout with my uh, NBA team. And then I didn't have enough to buy my own self out. So, you know what I'm saying? It was just like, I mean, I couldn't really take any of the offers that I had, so I had to go back to Bastogne. Went back, had a great year. Then, uh, then I still was getting some NBA looks in the, in the summertime, but I was just like, I mean, Pan is offering me more money than I ever heard of in my life, so I was just like, I should go there. That happened. <laughs> then obviously after that, I went to the Suns. I had a solid year, kinda, I guess. I had a solid three months, four Now months. you started, and then Kanan came in, and then you just got moved over? Like, what was that? What was that situation about? To just be honest, briefly. I still don't know, but I mean, uh, I mean, whatever happened, happened. I mean, yeah. you can't control your situation. That stuff happened. We left. I left. Came back to Panda. We lost to Luca. I'm about to shoot him left-handed next year. That's eight in a row right there. Mm -hmm. You never know, you might injure your right hand, you gotta shoot left hand, you know? Alright. Yes, sir. Here. Know your job, G. Just follow the guy. Make him use his body. You know what I mean? Make him use his strength. Gotcha. One, one. Yep. Here you go. Good. Work that one. Move. This one, this one. Oh. <laughs> so how much I know about basketball. Nice. Uh, I went back to that. One, three. You ready? Yep. Good jam. Yep. That's just that's unstoppable. <laughs> okay, uh, rest, weight vest off. Both of these unloaded. Good. Thank God. I feel like I'm about to die. Come on. I think I'm just tired. You good? Figure it out. Need more for next time. Ah! Last one. Don't stop playing. Don't stop playing. Keep, keep pushing. Let him work through it. Let him work through it. Come on. 
That is good. He needs to feel pressure, you know what I mean? Make him feel pressure. One, one. Be it! Two, three. You get a big break after this. Come on. Come on. Fuck. Okay. Come on. Yo, where did the reads come from, bro? What you mean? Where did you learn how to play, bro? Is it just you watching film or like you just got a knack for it, bro? I didn't start watching film until like last year <laughs> or the year before. Something like that. Well, it's the natural. So it's just natural if you're just playing mm -hmm. and reading. I mean, that's his name, Mr. Natural. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Where would I pass the ball here? I don't know. Yeah. It depends. You could be maybe yeah, right here and then yeah, you just cut through right. probably. If I was mellow. Correct. Hey. Hey, Maddie at hand. Is that what that was? Yeah. Come on. Last one. seen three people do this mike james ad and drew how tough is the shooting with that three, three top basketball players in the world so 20 pounds may not seem like a lot of weight but it's it's a, the accumulation of fatigue over course of time five minutes is a long time to shoot non-stop add 20 pounds to your body now you gotta really focus on your mechanics because as you get tired that's when mechanics and technique uh, bring you to success. No, no, I gotta give you a counter. What about, because some players would say, oh man, like that's kind of strenuous on his body. Strenuous in what what context? Like, because you have a weight vest on and you're shooting. So well, like, the thing how about do it I is, make it like to right. where, yeah. The beauty about this weight vest particularly is it's it's very comfortable on the body because it's it hugs the body. Okay. And it doesn't feel like a, uh, um, like it's moving around too much. Okay. So essentially it's a heavy shirt, yeah. a heavy tight Under Armour shirt or something like that. And um, you feel... Uh, short. Thank you. 
64, which is amazing. The thing that we need to really understand and realize is the first time we did this three weeks ago, he made 30 the first time loaded and 42 the second time unloaded. How would you say is like his conditioning improved over time? There remember? it is. It, the, num the, the proof is in the pudding. Numbers don't lie. So if, if he only makes 30 shots loaded, today he made, three weeks ago, today he made... 49 shots loaded he's already allowing his body to work for him because he's less tired and his shot mechanics right you know fatigue makes cowards of us all but if you're not fatiguing you're able to stay in form mm -hmm. 64 shots versus 42 shots in week one there it is efficiency right 